Microsoft has recently released Office for Mac 2011 version 14.2.4. This new software enables Retina machines to display Office for Mac 2011 content and Retina resolution. However, some users have reported that their machines are not yet taking advantage of this new software. Microsoft is working with Apple to identify the problem and resolve it. However, a timeline is not yet available. In the meantime, there is a quick and easy manual workaround that users can enact to make their machines fully functional with the update today. In this video, I will walk you through that process. The first step is to make sure no other applications are running. The white dot here under Safari indicates that Safari is open. Quit any applications that are open, especially making sure that the Office Suite is all closed. Next, go up to the top and go to Go. Go to Applications and scroll until you find Microsoft Office 2011. Hold down the Option button and drag this folder to your desktop. Note that since you're holding the Option button, the green circle with a plus shows up as you drag the folder. This indicates that you are copying the files, not moving the files. Wait for the copying to be completed. Now, go back to the original folder, click on it with two fingers, and select Move to Trash. The final step is to take your copied folder and move it back into your Applications folder. Note that we're not going to use the Option key here because we're moving the files, we're not copying the files. That's it. The, the Mac will now update and notice the new software, and as you open Office for Mac 2011, the Retina resolution will be enabled. We apologize for any inconvenience this has caused you. We thank you for using our software.